identifying software required for release 12.2.0 installation. Now, coming out of my own experience, when I started downloading from eDelivery website, I have struggled a bit in terms of understanding what software I should download because there are a number of softwares out there and I couldn't find a place wherein it's clearly written that these are the software required for release 12.2.0 and these are the software required from upgrading from release 12.2.0. So it took me a while to find out that and that's where you know I thought I should share that with you. So the first thing that we will do it is we'll minimize this and we'll go to eDelivery website and we will see where to download the software from. So first go to eDelivery.oracle.com which is this one and then log in with your user and password accept the license information these terms and conditions and then hit the continue button sometimes it's a bit slow is it not so just hold on for a minute that will lead you to a media pack search page so all you've got to do it is from this list you've got to choose a business suite okay and depends on your platform what you are in our case we have installed on Linux x86 64 but feel free to choose whichever platform you want and choose that and hit the go button and what will happen is okay let's do this again All right, don't know why it's come again. And then what will happen is it's gonna list you all the software you require to download. All right, from this list, as you could see, the latest one here is 12.2.2.4, but don't get deceived by this because that 2.4, the dot four is for Oracle and Dika media pack okay so what you've got to do it is you've got to click on the second one which says oracle e-business suite release 12.2.2 media pack for linux x 86 64 bit all right so click on that one and there you go so here as you could see there are a whole lot of software list over here so you can see you know starting from 12.2.0 you know all this and then if you keep scrolling down you also have media pack for 12.2.2 so what people will do who have not um, installed this software they simply um, download everything from here and you know start making the staging area for all the software but you don't have to do that you've got to select the software and in fact you should download only the ones which is from 12.2.0 plus you also have to download a couple of other things so to make your life easy what I have done is instead of all these software downloads I have simply written a small blog on our website so if you go to www.aclnz.com you simply go to resources and here from resources simply go down and hit the blocks and in the blocks I have written a blog for the software download so instead of scrolling down on the blogs because there are many many simply type 12.2.0 okay and hit the enter button and hopefully it should uh, get you the search and here scroll down and find the blog which is called as mandatory software requirement for Oracle a business suite 12.2.0 installation so click on this one and then here you can see the list out here so these are all the software that you must download from this e-delivery website so as you would see it doesn't contain everything but it clearly identifies basically every component that is required for 12.2.0 okay so just make sure that you align your download with what you have it over here and even though it says prod you've got to download this and uh, if you are installing the vision environment so you've got to download the CDs that's got this 
prod board in it as well as vision board in it while you are installing your vision demo database environment so scroll down it will also have two extra cds for or i should say three extra cds one is called as oracle e business suite release 12.2.0 for linux x8664 rapid install technology one off patches so this one you must install and then you've got this one oracle fusion middleware web tire utilities 11g patch set 5 11160 for Linux x86 64. Now, in this one, this is a little bit tricky because it doesn't have 12.2.0 word in it. So, you would never know that you've got to download it as a part of 12.2.0 installation. Likewise, you should also download, or in fact, you must download Oracle Web Logic Server 11G R1 1036 generic and coherence. This is also a must have CD. So, only when you download the software you would be successful in installing 12.2.0 and please make sure you don't download extra software while you are installing 12.2.0 you would require separate software for 12.2.2 which i will show you in the next movie